compilation of all my happy faces because guess what guys, I'm in my very own kitchen. Oh. Don't mind me. So today we are celebrating St David's Day, the patron saint of Wales. We're celebrating St David's Day with a blooming gorgeous Welsh recipe. I was really going to resist trying to do the Welsh accent and knowing that I'm going to offend someone, but we're going to do a little bit of Welsh rare bit. That was all right. Yeah which is essentially delicious cheese on toast, like the best version of cheese on toast you could possibly wish to eat. First up, got myself a beautiful sourdough loaf and we're going to cut out two chunky slices. I'm going to pop these in my toaster. Right, we're going to get on with our actual topping. So easy to make. Grab yourself a bowl and we're going to combine the following ingredients. So we're going to chop up two spring onions. If you want to go really Welsh, grab yourself some leeks. So we're going to pop our pan onto a medium to high heat and in with our onions. Whilst they are softening through and getting some nice cheeky caramelisation from that butter, we are going to combine 150 grams of creme fraiche. We're going to go for two egg yolks. So you've got your creme fraiche, your eggs. So we're going to go with 175 grams of cheese. 175 grams, in you go. We're also going to go in with two compulsory items. Liam Perrins, aka Worcester sauce. Worcester, Worcester sauce. Worcester. 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 Worcester sauce. Worcester sauce. Mum? Worcester. Worcester? Worcester. What is it? Worcestershire sauce. Worcestershire? Worcestershire. Worcestershire. Worcestershire sauce. Worcestershire sauce. Worcestershire. Worcestershire. Worcestershire sauce. Worcestershire sauce. Worcestershire. Yeah, Liam Perrins. We're going to go in with two teaspoons of Liam Perrins. One, two. And we're going to go two teaspoons of whole grain mustard. Okay, we're going to give that a good whip together. Get those eggs mixed. I am going to add a bit of salt and pepper into this too, season quite generously. I am happy with our little onions. They've got a nice bit of crispiness going on to them, but I don't want to take them too far. And we're going to chuck those into our cheese mixture too. There's our mixture looking delightful. Right, we're going to bring back our slices of bread. And then we're going to spoon our rarebit mixture directly on to our toast. Be generous, get it right up to the edges. And this is going to go into your grill until you start to see the top of that go gorgeously brown and start to bubble and dance. Oh, it's so outrageous. And I'm so excited for you to try it. And for me to try it. I'm just going to go for it pure and simple. Welsh rarebit, one of the finest creations to come out of Wales. It's so, so Moorish. You've got that sourness coming through from that lovely mature cheddar. The saltiness, that heat from the mustard, the lovely buttery spring onions adding a level of sweetness in there. It is outrageous. Please give this a go if you have. Make sure you let me know in the comments box below. Send me a picture on social media at the Katie Picks. And if you want to subscribe, I'm here every single Tuesday. And I'd love to have you around. Feel free to come join the party. Until next time. Oh my God, I'm going to food coma after this. Bye.